Hello and uh, welcome to this exciting tutorial. In this tutorial, we are going to be learning on how to use the ChatGPT plugins. And the ChatGPT has become so humongous that it has introduced serious plugins that are making it better by day. As you can see, they made the announcement on their uh, website about the plugins. And AI has been making drastic changes, giving ChatGPT great power. The most current change is its ability to collect data from web, which was previously limited up to September 2021. And then the most recent for ChatGPT4 is up to September 2022, which is so great that now we have a lot of current data already available on ChatGPT. One great thing that is new entrant is the use of chat GPT plugins, which is what we are going to be looking at in this video. Now, when you go to their website, you are going to notice that we have chat GPT plugins. And to use the plugins, you are required to join the plugs in list. Here, you simply click on that. And then you come down here to join wait list, where you are going to give your name, you give your email, and then you select the country of residence. Then whether we would be willing to give feedback, which I think is important, you select yes, because this will be important to them. And what you would want to use the plugs in for, whether you want to try it in ChatGPT, or if you're a developer and want to build a plugin, and after that you join the wait list. So again, to get to that site, you simply come to openai.com forward slash waiting list forward slash plugins so that you can now get to this page. So currently, ChatGPT has two built-in plugins, one of them including browsing and uh, quite a good number of third-party plugins. And for the third-party plugins, you simply scroll down and here they are. These are the plugins that are available to be used in chat GPT. So you see we have Expedia, we have Fisconaut, we have Kayak, we have uh, Shop, we have Zapier. Like for the Expedia, for the Expedia it will help you with the planning to do with the flights and transportation. Kayak will help you with the flights and stay in such a uh, such as rental cars and all that as you travel. So you can see this is great, great change and great, great improvement on open AI. And this open AI chat GPT has been making changes every now and then. After a few days, they make one great improvement on their AI. Now, one such humongous thing that has come in is Zapier. Zapier down here. So you notice, that Zapier can interact with over 5,000 plus apps like Google Sheets, Trello, Gmail, HubSpot, Salesforce, and uh, more. If we go to Zapier website, you notice the many apps that it can connect with. This is just part of them. We have Gmail, we have the mail, we have Shopify, we have Asana, we have Facebook. We have all these apps that Zapier connects with. So by having chat GPT connect to Zapier, it means therefore that you are therefore automatically connected to this, which is a great, great plan for chat GPT because of that great, great improvement. So if I come here to Zapier website and search for chat GPT, Automatically, it takes me to chat GPT integration, which is currently, however, available for the beta that is still under beta. So you can do more with chat GPT integration. You connect chat GPT to 5,000 plus apps, which is a great, great thing. And you notice down here, they actually give you another list of these apps, which if I scroll next, it gives me another list including here you can see Zoom included, uh, Google Assistant, Basecamp 3, Spotify is here, Zoom again, Microsoft Teams. So this is quite humongous that I'm able to connect ChatGPT to all this. 
Remember, you can also search for the app that you would need here on the search button. This is very great flexibility that now you are able to just log into ChatGPT and you are able to connect to all these apps. Another great plugin that you are able to use in ChatGPT is the Wolfram. Now, the Wolfram helps you to access complicated computation procedures, that is for maths, curated knowledge, and real-time data through Wolfram Alpha. So if I go to the Wolfram Alpha, you notice that this is also called the computational intelligence, which is a great thing in doing mathematical calculations. You notice here it has the step-by-step -step solutions. It has units and measures, people. Down here we have physics, elementary math, algebra, chemistry. If we scroll down, you notice it is quite unlimited, including engineering, computational sciences, earth sciences. We have geometry, differential equations, and all this. Wolfram Alpha is able to do that. And the beauty of it is that now, you will only need to be on chat GPT, then you'll be able to log in or to access the Wolfram computational feature available now on chat GPT. So if you scroll down here, you notice that on their website, they even have an example of the uh, examples of how to use the chat GPT. And they have also used videos which you can play. They have the overview, they have the safety and broader implications. And then down here, this is one of the built-in plugins in ChatGPT, that is the browsing. And this one gets your data the same way from Microsoft, but the beauty of it is that it explains the process. So that is just a sample video on uh, how this works. And they have several other videos and explanations on this same, same site. And they even have demonstrations down here of how calculations can be done. There are brick ways, 30% of the brick. You notice how they have done the computation down here. And this is a great way because you end up now getting a very accurate answer down here. And of course, the process on how that answer was arrived at. You're also able to get interpretation in terms of graphs. You notice that here we have a graph and uh, it also draws for you the graphs on chat GPT, solves the calculation, then does the maths for you, explains what it's doing, and all this is available on chat GPT through the plugins that it's just about to introduce and some that have already been introduced. We have the chat GPT retrieval plugin demo. Again, again, you can watch that video there. And this chat GPT, that party plugins are basically unlimited. It has just introduced unlimited ability, unlike when it was before it was introduced. So again, for you to use the plugins, you will need to join the waiting list as we have already demonstrated, and you'll be able to experience the humongous power of chat GPT plugins. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you love it. Kindly like this video, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel.